food. The ultimate secret exposed up on Infowars.com and PrisonPlanet.com. And I want to add now an addendum to this 15-minute piece that we're also posting in the highest quality at PrisonPlanet.tv right now. Maryland bans chemical BPA linked to medical issues. And it says not only is it linked to impotency, but its more serious side effects were highlighted Thursday as a ban on the substance came into effect in Maryland. Maryland was the fourth U.S. state to ban the chemical bisphenol A, commonly known as BPA, which was linked to early puberty, childhood obesity, autism, reproductive problems, breast cancer, and other medical issues like sterility. The chemical is often found in baby bottles and is common in clear plastic food and drink containers. BPA is thought to leach into the container contents when heated. Thousands of different formulas of plastic. This was the one adopted in the last 50 years worldwide. We'll finish up with this, get into food irradiation, meat, produce, you name it. When we come back, this is key information. Stay with us. live and I only scratched the surface in that special 15 minute presentation food the ultimate secret revealed now a lot of you already know this information but we presented it with the documents with the mainstream news articles uh, with images of uh, what is in these different foods and what's being put in your water and we show images of the large packages of fluoride that says deadly poison on it that's being put in your water supply Everyone needs to see this because the general public is not aware of just how serious this is. It's not just that, oh, junk food's bad for you or too much fluoride's bad for you. This is being put in there by design. We have the government white papers and corporate and university and UN documents. We cover it in my film, Endgame, Blueprint for Global Enslavement. This is the major issue. And here's Fox News. Maryland bans chemical BPA, and it goes on. Uh, to say that it's for only babies. Well, fluoride hurts children and babies, the studies show, a lot more than it hurts adults. But you don't hear that being banned. No, they push it on children. In fact, we have government documents that Aaron showed me last night that I intend to do a piece on next week where they're actually at many public schools in England and the U.S. have fluoride uh, systems hooked up not making it one part per million, but four parts per million. And you know, they come into the schools with those little red fluoride pills. I remember when that would happen to me in first and second grade, I would take it and then get sick and have a headache and be throwing up by the time my mom picked me up after school. And no one ever put two and two together. And, and the teachers and dentists think they're helping you, but this is an IQ reduction. Fluoride also attacks and sterilizes you. Fox News goes on. Meanwhile, Berlin-based urologist Professor Frank Sommer told the London Daily Telegraph on Tuesday that men could ingest enough BPA from its use in receipts alone. It's, it's commonly used as the black ink to suppress male hormones in the body and reduce fertility or even sterilize you. That's Fox News. Here is the Baltimore Sun. Senate passes BPA ban in bottles, cups for small children. There's no reason. This has been chosen and adopted because it's meant to sterilize you. Now, continuing, if you just search the term food irradiation, you'll learn the EPA approved this in the last decade, and they're irradiating beef, poultry, fish, uh, produce, and it destroys the food value. It breaks the ring structures in the food, and it's basically dead food you're now eating, and it loses most of its nutritional value. That's another issue uh, that we didn't even get into uh, in this piece. And the list just goes on and on and on. There are hundreds of petrochemical distillates, the leftovers of oil uh, refining, that are put as, quote, flavor enhancers and things to... Uh, preserve food as preservatives that are highly toxic. And that's that processed food taste that, that you become accustomed to. But once you've stopped eating a lot of processed food, it tastes like crud. I remember when I was a kid eating processed food going, mm, what's that kind of dirty taste, that spicy, toxic taste that you eat in processed foods? Well, it's, 
it's things like the chemical and city uh, silly putty and, and that's not alex jones saying that that's cnn admitting oh silly putty plastic chemical a, a type of silicone is in all these different processed foods these different tv dinners chicken mcnuggets taco bell shells what came out a few years ago about taco bell they had on their store shelves what they were selling people at the fast food restaurant, the Starlink corn that wasn't even approved for humans, and they had to recall it because the, the violent reactions people had were so bad they couldn't cover it up. And the government approves it. These corporations are advised to use it. It's cheap, and they do. Please investigate this for yourself and get that video and get it out to everyone today. It is so important that we warn everyone. We can beat these people if we do it together. You are listening to GCN. Visit GCNlive.com today.